Hey everyone, I'm Megan Remblack and welcome to my channel, Meg Rem Softball. This is a great drill to work on tracking the ball all the way in before you swing. So as a hitter, you want to make sure you find that ball before that pitcher is even starting in her motion, find that ball. You should be watching the ball the entire way, through the motion, to the release, all the way in to the plate. You want to be able to see how that ball leaves her hand, uh, if it's going to be more of an inside pitch or an outside pitch. So it's important to see where it's coming because an inside pitch, the timing is going to be a little, as you were catching that ball out front, opposed to an outside pitch, we should let that ball travel a little bit deeper. So it's different timing there. So if we're just getting up there, swinging to swing, our time is going to be all off. We're not going to be very consistent. So we want to make sure that we're doing a very good job at tracking the ball all the way in. So this drill is going to help us with that. So I'm a righty. I've got five balls across the plate. The one closest to me is gonna be ball number one. Then I have ball two, ball three, ball four, and ball five. We're gonna be taking normal front toss. I'm gonna to be swinging normal. Once I swing, the second I'm done swinging, I'm gonna tell my front tosser which ball, the ball that came in, which one it came over. So for example, if I get a, uh, a pitch on the inside corner, right on the inside corner and I swing, I'm swinging and I'm saying one because this is ball one. If I get a perfect pitch down the middle, swing, three. Uh, the idea here is you don't wanna sit and think too much like after you swing, I'm like, okay, you know, let me think about this. You should be swing, right after you swing, make contact, four or whichever number it is because you wanna really make sure that you're watching that ball leave the pitcher's hand. Uh, so again, it's really important if we're um, just swinging to swing, we're not going to be very consistent. If it's an inside pitch, you have to catch that out a, bit, a little bit further. And an outside pitch, you have to see that a little bit deeper. Track the ball, uh, make sure, and also too with the hitters uh, or the front tossers, it doesn't have to be perfect. Let's say, you know, it's down the middle and they say two. At least it's not a ball in, inside and they're saying five. So if it's close, not a big deal, just making sure that they can recognize if it's more of a middle in, middle out, down the middle. And this is what it'll look like full speed. 